Screw the rules, he's got money. I'm Ashley with Watch Mojo, and these are the top 10 monster cards in Seto Kaiba's deck. Paladin, attack with Ionic Spear Burst! For this list, we're looking at some of the most notable beasts wielded by Yugi's most recurring and persistent rival. And yes, we are acknowledging his dragon fetish. Next, I'll use polymerization to fuse them both together, forming twin-headed Thunder Dragon! If you've never seen these cards in action, there will be spoilers. And once we're done with this list, head over to my Twitter at AshJBo and let me know which Yu-Gi-Oh character you want us to cover next. Rare card. Could they have found the card that I've been searching for? Number 10, Sagi, the Dark Clown. Who knew Kaiba was down with the clown? During the Duelist Kingdom tournament, one of Kaiba's recurring and arguably the creepiest card in his deck was this heinous harlequin, Sagi the Dark Clown. Dark Clown, attack with dark light! While he's not much to look at and is a bit of a lightweight, he can definitely pack a punch with the right power boost. During the latter half of the tournament, Sagi became a vessel for one of Kaiba's most deadly combo moves. By infecting his clown with the Crush Card Virus, he is able to wipe out every card with over 1,500 attack points in his opponent's deck. Vanquished and sacrificed are two very different things, Yugi. Look again! No! What's happening? Unfortunately, once Pegasus was able to counter Kaiba's infestation scheme, Sagi didn't get many more chances to shine after that. Forgive me, Mokuba. I am so sorry. <sighs> <laughs> Number 9, Force Raider. With Kaiba's high-level monsters being harder to summon, thanks to the series finally adapting the sacrificial summon rule, it never really hurts to have a low-level heavy hitter in your arsenal. Force Raider Attacker Keldo now! One of these monsters is one of Kaiba's most overlooked warriors, the Force Raider. With 1900 attack points, this grisly beast warrior delivers a devastating blow with its axe. If needed, Kaiba can also use his Shrink Magic Card to reduce his gruesome combatant strength to make him more compatible with the Crush Card Virus combo, making this beast a suitable replacement for the retired Saki the Dark Clown. Force Raider, attack now! Whether by slicing up his enemies or infesting their decks, Kaiba can always count on Force Raider to charge onto the field with a sadistic grin. Number 8, Blue Eye Shining Dragon. In the anime's first theatrical film, Kaiba manages to acquire the tools he believes can help him defeat Yugi and his Egyptian god cards, one of them being the Blue Eye Shining Dragon. By offering his Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon as a tribute, Kaiba can call out this glistening incarnation of the original White Dragon, and it gains 300 attack points for every dragon in his graveyard. Shining Neutron Blast! Not only that, but it can negate the effect of any monster, magic, or trap card that threatens it and can even sacrifice itself to destroy any card of Kaiba's choosing. While Kaiba never got a chance to use it on Yugi's god cards, Yugi made good use of the Shining Dragon by foiling the evil Anubis' scheme. No! Number 7, Lord of Dragons. Unfortunately, even Kaiba's mighty dragons can be vulnerable. That's where the Lord of Dragons himself comes in. As long as this monarch is on the field, all dragon cards on the field are safe from card effects. I summon Lord of Dragons! As long as it's on the field, my blue eyes is safe from all magic and trap cards! Not only that, but by playing the flute of summoning dragon, his majesty can special summon up to two dragons to the field, including a certain white dragon. 
And next, I'll summon a monster known as the Lord of Dragons! During the Virtual World arc, Kyber chose this mighty ruler to be one of his deck masters, and it's easy to see why. With his command over colossal lizards and being able to protect them, this is one lord that any dragon duelist would greatly benefit from having in their deck. Now, my deck master, show your special ability! At a cost of 500 of my life points, Lord of Dragons allows me to summon any dragon from my hand. Number 6. The Fang of Critias Dragons Alright, I'm just about ready to wake up from this dream. During the Waking the Dragons arc, Kyber unlocked the Fang of Critias card, which could fuse with three of his best trap cards to unlock a trinity of destructive dragon fusion monsters. Combining Critias with Mirror Force brings forth the Mirror Force Dragon, with the power to rebound the opponent's attack and destroy all their monsters. Absorb reflection! Activate! Merging with Tyrant Burst creates the Tyrant Burst Dragon, which can merge with any dragon and grant them 400 attack points. Finally, fusing with Kyber's iconic crush card virus unleashes the Doom Virus Dragon to obliterate all the opponent's monsters with over 1500 attack points. While each dragon only made one major appearance each, their special abilities help them stand out and give Kyber an advantage against Dance's evil. Now Doom Virus Dragon attack his life points directly! Game over. Number 5. Deep Eyes White Dragon In the Dark Side of Dimensions movie, Kyber pulls out all the stops to try and beat Yugi and bring the Pharaoh back by loading his deck with an army of new, all-powerful dragons. With this Deep Eyes White Dragon! After the defeat of his Chaos Max Dragon, Kaiba was able to call out one of these mighty brutes. The Deep Eyes White Dragon, a deadly 10-star monster with the ability to inflict 600 damage for each dragon type in his graveyard. I don't think even the Pharaoh can save you anymore. You're finished. Not only can this mighty dragon pack a punch with its ability to copy another of his dragon's attacks, but it can also destroy all monsters on the field if it's somehow defeated. Just where does Kaiba find all these blue eyes? Deep Eyes White Dragon! This is it, Yugi. It's over. Number 4. XYZ Dragon Cannon Not unlike Yugi's Magnet Warriors, Kaiba brought in his own trinity of robotic beasts during Battle City. The Union Monsters X-Head Cannon, Y Dragon Head, and Z Metal Tank. By banishing all three machines, they come together to form the most devastating machine in Kaiba's deck, the XYZ Dragon Cannon. Meet XYZ Dragon Cannon! Along with a hefty 2800 attack points, this militant monster has a sneaky surprise effect. By tossing out one card, Kaiba can destroy any card his opponent controls once per turn which is always handy for those pesky field spells. Now XYZ Dragon Cannon attack his monster! This literal battle tank also earns brownie points for its unique ability to be fusion summoned without using polarization, which saves Kyber and us a lot of trouble. It's time to get rid of your little friend! Along with the horse she rode in on! Dragon Cannon Attack! Ah! Number 3. Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon Each one of Kaiba's fierce Blue Eyes White Dragons is a powerhouse on their own, but when he fuses all three together, they form the enormous three-headed beast with unimaginable power, the Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon. Ultimate Dragon! With a heavy hitting 4500 attack points, there are very few who can surpass this creature's majesty. In fact, the only real way Yugi could ever defeat the Ultimate Dragon was to split it back into three dragons or use more unconventional strategies to weaken it. No! I need my Ultimate Dragon to win the duel! This can't be happening! 
It can also unite with Yugi's Blackluster Soldier to form the Invincible Dragon Master Knight, the unmatched symbol of both rivals working together to defeat their common enemies. Number 2. Obelisk the Tormentor During his Battle City tournament, Kaiba sought the ultimate power of all three Egyptian god cards after being gifted the mighty Obelisk the Tormentor. It's Obelisk the Tormentor! I thought the cards were stolen! I never said they were all stolen. I managed to retrieve one in time. It's not hard to see why he'd want all three. Obelisk alone is a massive titan with 4,000 attack and defense points and a devastating Fist of Fate. Obelisk, Fist of Fate! Not only that, but Obelisk is almost immune to all magic, trap, and monster effects. And Kaiba can tribute two monsters to his almighty god and obliterate all monsters his opponent controls. Obelisk, attack Umbra's life points directly! Unfortunately, even with this mighty ace monster, Kaiba's quest for power was ultimately for naught as Yugi knocked him out of the finals, winning Obelisk for himself. Behold! The Egyptian God card I won from Kaiba! Before we unveil our number one pick, here's some honorable mentions. I summon La Jin, the mystical genie. <laughs> My wish is his command. The Judge Man, with an attack power of 2200. Why should I stop at two blue eyes? When I can dimension summon a third one! Blue Eyes Alternative White Dragon! Before we continue, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. You have the option to be notified for occasional videos or all of them. If you're on your phone, make sure to go into your settings and switch on notifications. Number 1. Blue Eyes White Dragon Come on, we all saw this coming. This majestic dragon is so rare that only four cards of it were ever made in the anime. Of course, Kaiba made sure that he's the only one to possess their power. And look at the sweet prize I won. Uh, Grandpa's most treasured card! It's been said that Blue Eyes is a symbol of power and pride, which perfectly fits Kaiba since those are two of his biggest motivations. Blue Eyes attack his gazelle with white lightning! In Egyptian times, Kaiba's ancient incarnation, Priest Seto, shared a deep bond with a young woman who carried the Blue Eyes' spirit, making Kaiba's obsession with the dragon a lot deeper than just a thirst for power. No matter the counterparts, we all recognize the Blue Eyes as both Kaiba's staple monster and one of the most iconic Yu-Gi-Oh monsters of all time. Wipe out her life points with White Lightning Attack! Farewell. Do you agree with our picks? Check out this other recent clip from Watch Mojo, and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.